Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I want to show us how we can find the area of this type of a triangle. Alright, solution. Alright, this triangle is a scalar triangle. It has all the size to be unequal. So we are not going to use half base times height because the vertical height is not given and uh, we don't have any angle. So now we are going to use this formula to find the area and uh, the area of this triangle is given to be square root we have s open bracket s minus a then we have s minus b and s minus c All right so what is s what is a what is b and what is c right from this diagram we can say this place is a side a we say this place is side b and we say this place is side c and what is s s is the semi perimeter is the semi perimeter of this triangle and there uh, how do you calculate the semi perimeter you know perimeter is the addition of the boundaries the edges but then semi perimeter is the addition of the boundaries we divide it by two so we say the semi perimeter is equals to a plus b plus c over 2. All right, so that gives the semi perimeter of this triangle. Okay, we know what our a is. Our a is 6, our b is 11, and our c is 9. We need to find our semi perimeter first before we can find the area of this triangle. Now, let's continue. Our s equals to a is 6, b is 11. And C is 9. Everything divided by 2. So we have this plus this plus this. We have it to be 26 over 2. Then 2 in 26 is 13. It means our S equals to 13. Then we can use that in our formula. Remember that I said the area of that triangle is square root of S. S minus A s minus b s minus c all right so we do that what is our s our s is 13 13 multiplying 13 minus our a is 6 our s is 13 our b is 11 and the last one our s is 13 and our c is 9 okay so now we have square roots 13, 13 minus 6 is 7, and 13 minus 11 is 2, 13 minus 9 is 4. Now we multiply all these, 13 times 7 times 2 times 4, we give 728, and then we can find square root of 728 is 26.98. So it means the area of the triangle is approximately 26.98 meters squared. And that is the final answer. All right, so let's do something similar to that. Now let's try, let's try this. We have a triangle. Okay. This is 15 centimeter. We have this place to be 4 centimeter and this place to be 5 centimeter. So the question is we should find the area of this triangle. Find the area of this triangle. Alright, guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share this video, and if you have not subscribed to this channel, please and please subscribe. See you next time.